It's Phil Woolery with Purdue Extension, and it's Wednesday at the Stark County 4-H Fair. So the big thing going on today is the swine show. So let's go down there and check out what's going on. about it when you show. Um, going into when you show, when you show you'll need a stick, a brush, and honestly you'll probably need a rag too. Um, when you show just make sure to have fun, keep your eye on the judge, and keep your pigs out of the corners and off of the rails and you'll do great. The difference between the barrows and gilts, barrows are boy pigs and gilts are girl pigs. We have different breeds or different sections at the Stark County Fair. Um, a market gilt, you are looking for more profound muscles in the market gilt, and you are wanting them to be market ready. A breeding gilt, you are looking for more of a mother sow, and you want some softer corners on her, and you want her to be um, ready to be able to breed. competition out in the ring today in the swine show. Kids do a good job exhibiting their animals, just make them look the best for the judge. And they also did a, a really good job learning about the swine and, and taking care of them over the, the year. Now I think the project building is open, so I think I'm gonna go head over there and take a look. So this is one of my favorite projects to come and check out, the architectural models. So a lot of them use uh, the Legos and you can use, um, do a kit or you can um, make your own design. So you see some of them for both of them. So um, it's a really nice get the kids that get to exhibit their creativity in their projects here. And with uh, with the uh, older kids, they'll have to do more in in larger projects and more intricate designs with moving parts. 
So some of these other projects, we've got lots of things with posters where they learn about different things and tell about their knowledge. So here's geology, um, looking at different rocks in Indiana, minerals, rock types, um, Indiana limestone. And here's the an entomology project. And I like these. I did this when I was in 4-H and I had lots of insects collected there. So that's always fun to look at. Here are the Exploring 4-H projects here. These are for younger kids and they're just learning about 4-H and the different types of things they can do. So they do an exhibition here at the fair, of lots of different things they, that they, they do. So some things we have coming up tonight at the fair. There is the horse and pony grand entry and some more horse and pony shows. Uh, some other things, there's square dancing tractors. I believe there's a magic show or two and lots of different other activities for everyone to enjoy. We'll see you next time.